Let's start activating. The breathing activation is an inverted Y. So we'll start at the bottom. On either side, you want to find your bottom rib and all the way out kind of to the edge. And you're going to work up that rib bone all the way to the center here. And then from your sternum all the way up to that little hole right there. You're not going to go in. That feels gross. You're going to stay right on the edge of that bone. So again, we're going to take two fingers, your thumb. Sometimes I use the knuckle of my thumb, especially on my ribs. And what you want to do is find that rib and you want to stay right on that bottom rib. So you don't want to duck under and you don't want to fall in between the two. You want to stay right on that rib and you just want to kind of rock back and forth. Remember we've got straight pressure, we've got making a T, or we've got circles. And you just want to work up, stay on that rib and just work up. So when you find a place that's, that hurts or is thick tissue or just something weird, you can just press on it. And then when you're ready, start to make small circles. And when you feel like you've done enough on that area, just move up a little bit. Remember, your ribs come out and then they go up. And when you're in this middle part right here, which is usually under your sports bra band, it's a horseshoe shape. There's a piece of bone that sticks down. And you want to work just around the horseshoe, but not on that bone. So you can find there's like a, a corner where your ribs go up. So this corner is pretty, pretty meaty. So you want to find that and just stay on it. And press. Whew. You can always stop and breathe. Remember, in through your nose, big air in your belly, out through your mouth. When you get up to the meaty part, your sternum, you may have to pull your sports bra down a little bit to get there. Get down on that bone and the same thing. Your two fingers of pressure, you're just going to work your way up. All the way up. You're going to go all the way up to that hole. And then when you start back over at the bottom, I want you to, there's a center line, and I want you to fall just off the center line to the outside. You'll feel where your pecs and your boobs come in, and that tissue sort of uh, binds down onto the sternum. And that's just where we're looking to work up, up the side. So this whole activation, the inverted Y, should take about three to five minutes depending on what you find and how much time you want to spend on it. Happy activating!